snow in. Look at all the purple shapes. I'm pretty sure I can't salvage anything purple. Looks like the exit right there. Show is pretty. Come quickly. 
We have been waiting for you. Speak with us. Speak with Akara the Exile. We are the Exile. We did not desire to play the games of men and monsters. So we departed, seeking solace. On this island we took root, and here we first heard the cries of the lost, touched the tears of the broken. Quicklings bear such fragile yearnings. You need guidance. You need protection. I guess you are exiled. The souls at rest above know nothing. They know only what we reveal. They know what brings them peace, what gives them hope. That is how it was for many passing seasons. But now, all of it must come to an end. We are but one branch of the great tree, the ring of Kiyozai, the watchers of our withering world. Only as a god would we be heard, and only as disciples would the people listen. To plant seeds, to inspire hope, to save. That is why we reached out to the Quicklings. But look at what our influence has wrought. Such a monster can only be born from power, and power will be the tool to unmake him. That is what we want. The unmaking of dead Kel. We with the Twelve, the sons and daughters of the Lagru, and the branches through which all wisdom whispers, we are the Ring. Yes, Quickling. That is why I created the Scion. You are the vessel through which destruction will finally find dead Kel. That was always the purpose of the Blessing. To give one individual the power to end this grievous cycle. Now, do what you came to do. End him, and end us. Think of it as one last offering to a grateful God. Akara will be no more. So, it has come to this. I have nothing left to give you. Nothing but my hate. Nothing but my blade. From the moment that you crawled across our beaches, Akara has beckoned to you. He has called you by name. Through Alder, through the old man Key, and perhaps even through me. In you, Kara can purge himself of any guilt. That is why you must die. Because you have been given all the tools with which to conquer me. But dead Kel does not surrender. The Alpha surprised me. Their war galleys waited just off the coast. Majors at the ready. It was over in seconds. Broken and bloody. I washed into these forgotten caverns and prepared my soul for it. That is when Akara, and I had cheated the Oh my god. I'm tired of hearing this fucking same shit over and over. I had won. Spare me your pity. All I want is the power, and that is lost to me yet again. Many have died. What is 
I am a predator. Killing is what sustains me. But the sea does not judge. It only silences the screams. Oh my god, the All shitty I've fucking done, writing. I'm just killing. No one knows that truth more than I do. And you believe you are the one who will fix Akara's mistake? No. Not like this. I will take what belongs to me, what I should have received in exchange for my free will. I will get it from Akara, or take it from you. Are you ready? Dead cow, where's dead cow? <laughs> I've had if I really tried hard enough, I could have just like suspended him in the air the entire time. <laughs> Ship. It's my ship. The fuck you mean your ship? I'm the one that stole it. I didn't even get no help. Everybody's always like, please settle that, please. Take this. Hi there! You have me worried. 
Honestly, why do you act like that? Throwing yourself headlong into dangerous situations. No more. Do you hear me? If you and I are going to woo, and woo with vigour, you're going to be more considerate of my needs. And there are many. <laughs> like sex. I, I mean sex. To show that you're my consort, you should take this. It's a sword. It was my mother's. She was a terrible person. In my experience, islands are places you visit in order to escape torment and certain death. Ugh, Gallows End is one destination I will avoid on future voyages. Unless I crash there, of course. I captained my first ship when I was no bigger than my papa's knee and promptly crashed it into the dock, sinking three vessels with one wreck. It was then that I knew my destiny was to be a sailor. From that day forward, I spent my life on the water. 20 ships in 20 years. It must be some kind of record. Not as immortal as everyone supposed, was he? As my mother always said, if you can't be the best at something, find the best, grab onto them, and never let them go. Don't go far. Welcome back. Perhaps Nina Malloy was welcome back. Yeah. Uh oh, what the hell is that? My phone? Phone, what's wrong? I hate you crying out in horror. <laughs> Go get me a puppy.